What's up, guys? Uh, it's time for Season 5, Episode 14, Canterlot Boutique. And it's a little late. It's currently, oh, 4.06 in the morning. Uh, I've been recording Season 5 stuff all day. And then I had, like, a five-hour-long Discord call with my friends. And now I recorded the Rainbow Rock shorts. So my voice is a little, a little shot. I don't know if it's noticeable. And... I may be a little tired, I won't be as energetic as I usually am. But don't get me wrong, this isn't going to ruin the episode for me. <laughs> like, I'm totally fine. Like, I'm really into this. There's n I, don't, I don't have any burnout, I don't have any fatigue for it. I'm all good. I just won't be as oh, Pinkie Pie-like <laughs> during my reactions. So, yeah. This is probably the last one I'm going to record. Maybe I'll record one more after this, I don't know, for today. But yeah. I need to sleep because I haven't slept. <laughs> Three, two, wait, I need to do my reaction. Not my reaction, my prediction. Jesus Christ, I need sleep. <laughs> Candlelight Boutique. It's rarity. <laughs> this is a rarity episode. <coughs> this is a rarity episode. No doubt about it. Uh, I love me some rarity. I love rarity a ton. So let's get to it. Three, two, one. One, play. It starts with sophisticated music for rarity, of course. Wearing a cute glasses. <laughs> what are you waiting on? <gasps> Was that the pony post? You're very oh, on the fritz. Just you, Opal. I'm gonna play with your like kitty. Work, but not today. What could possibly be holding him up? Narrated of all seven, and they're gonna make a perverted comment on what I just said. What? What indeed? I bet you're wondering what warrants such a welcome. Well, that welcome is warranted by a pony that whisked up a warm batch of strawberry cinnamon cilantro. What's with the alliteration? <laughs> that strangely sickening flavor combination sounds just as bad as it tastes. Ugh. So I came here to offer you. Oh God. <laughs> Why? Descriptive and disturbing endorsement. I pass. Yeah. Oh, I almost forgot. I have this letter for you, Rarity. Oh, the post pony was going to deliver cupcakes all over. Strawberry cinnamon cilantro cupcake. He was Ca killing Karen. She taped it to her off. <laughs> I was heading over anyway. I figured I could do it for him. At least they did something to have explain it. <laughs> what? <laughs> Damn, she's excited. I have been holding out for the perfect location, and it finally became available. So now I can what? fulfill my dream of opening a boutique in Canterlot. Oh, hell yeah. I'm you so are? Excited. I think I'm going to lose my head. That is like a dream come true. Nice. I'm, I'm really happy for you, Rarity. Yeah. Awesome. My little Let's do it. My little pony. <laughs> I used to wonder what friendship could be Until I stayed up till 4.30 Big adventure Tons of fun A beautiful heart Faithful and strong Sharing kindness It's an easy feat And magic makes it all complete to have mine Do you know you are my very best friend? Damn, I'm still recovering that Luna episode The more I think about it, the more I think about how dark it is Of what was in that episode Business pony, I'm so impressed she used the huge bonus she earned making the costumes for Sapphire Shores. A we all know she seduced her way into it. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, Rarity definitely, I'm sure, earned it through pleasant means. It's lovely. Gosh, Rarity, it's simply divine. I work when I see it, and it looks like you worked your hooves to the nub. Aren't hooves already <laughs> nubs? And sexy. However, I never could have gotten the boutique ready for the grand opening without the help of my new manager, Sassy Saddles. Sassy Saddles. Bust my buttons, Rarity. Huh. Ponies from Ponyville. Sassy. She has a I long horn. 
special at Carousel. So when Sassy showed me her resume, and I saw that she worked in all of the finest boutiques in Canterlot, I hired her right Ooh, on the spot. Sorry, I'm a bit tired. Out this plan, or pattern, as we say in the fashion biz, for Canterlot <laughs> Carousel, so that Rarity's boutique will be a guaranteed success, and those doors will never, ever, ever close. I like wow, the sound Sassy, of that, but that's not what's going to happen, is it? Truly impressive. I've already put a pin in the otherwise, why would there be an episode? Beautify the boutique. But next was the very crucial pattern piece. Marketing to the mares. Turns out what about us dudes? We want to get some fashion. Royalty. So I created a collection that beautifully revolves around the royal element of Canterlot. And it just so happens there's a hot new princess in Equestria. In every a hot new princess. Prince. <laughs> most popular princess. Coincidentally, one of my gowns is inspired I'm by sorry. the window in Canterlot Castle commemorating your coronation. Ooh. Now that's a fancy frock. Now that's a fancy frock. <laughs> Thanks, AJ. I've taken my latest collection to a whole new level with Rarity's Rules of TLC. Judging by this baby, <laughs> TLC stands for Tasty Licorice Candy. TLC Tender Love and Care. Love and oh. I do agree that this dress has potential. Okay. <laughs> enough time to give it enough love to become couture. But the rest of the gowns in tonight's line have met Rarity's rules and are ready to be presented. My nice. marketing research also confirmed that customers that viewed some pony famous wearing a gown wished to own that gown for themselves. Mm, I think I see what her problem pattern, is. She's too focused on business. So, Twilight, we were wondering if perhaps you might possibly wear this tonight? If being a princess and wearing that dress can help your boutique in any way, then I say, stick a pin in it. It's done. <laughs> All right, I, I'll sell my soul Set for you. Ever since I was a little filly, all I've ever wanted was to own a boutique here in Canterlot. So nice. Pinch me. I'm about to open I'm the so door happy and for you. <laughs> Welcome to the grand opening of Bitch. Canterlot Carousel. This is her moment. Oh, I see where this is going. Sassy Saddles. Welcome, welcome. Oh, welcome. Sassy totally stepped on your home. Oh, yeah, I need to paint this in the background. Oh, no. If I see Starlight again. Oh, okay. Phew. Oh, I don't think she meant to. Rarity, are you ready to reveal the collection? Are you ready to get out of her spotlight? Do it herself. Yeah. Yes, I am. Fluttershy, could you help Twilight get ready? Oh, certainly. Fillies and gentle colts, I am designer and couturier. Don't Rally. get up here, sassy. I would like to welcome you again <laughs> to the grand opening of Canterlot Carousel. And I'm thrilled that you're here to see my newest collection inspired by this regal city. Oh, dang. Those look good. What are you doing, Set? Rarity, I'm fashion plate of Cosmere magazine. Cosmere. I'm so honored that Cosmere was able to do a piece on the grand opening of my boutique. Well, when Sassy saddles Carl, saying she's found the latest and greatest in fashion, free <laughs> high tail without fail. Now tell me all about your latest collection. Oh my God, this guy. <laughs> Rarity's royal regalia. <gasps> Oh my, my god. Part of being a designer is finding my inspiration, and that really wasn't difficult when it came to Canterlot. Everywhere I looked, the world you want to stop using magic, magic everywhere? I call it inspiration. Genius! Set the genius! <laughs> <laughs> this guy seems alright. On the castle grounds, which inspired this gown, Water Billy. Oh, the whimsy! Watching <laughs> Celestia raise the sun each morning literally lit up my day. This is tripping the light. Fantastic! <laughs> oh my god. That's a mean face. <laughs> and of course, Luna raising the moon guided me to sleep. The moon? I call this she said that over weird. the moon. The moon? Why did she say well, moon like that? I certainly am. <laughs> and for our finale, that guy's I have good. something very special. <laughs> I was inspired by the stained glass window created in honor of Princess Twilight. So I call this. <laughs> <laughs> Calm down, dude. <laughs> The dress is inspired by the stained glass window of a rainy princess. Yes. Well, <coughs> yes. Rain in stain is too difficult to explain. Especially.
especially for the signature Sassy, of a collection. Sassy, shut up. But I rather like the fillies and gentle goats. I, Sassy Saddles, am pleased to introduce the grand finale of the grand you are. of Rarity's royal regalia. The princess dress. <gasps> I'll take it. <laughs> you can leave the dress or whatever off, but I'll take the I'll take the twilight. <laughs> How about just the princess? I'll Very sign right I'm now. The best party to congratulate you. And the princess dress has just guaranteed Canterlot Carousel success. Yeah, Rarity's royal regalia is amazing, and every pony seemed to love the Hey, you got some. Dress. You had another set of wings. <laughs> they did. Rarity now has one hundred orders for her signature gown. Does that mean she has to make 100 dresses? One time? According to my pattern, the next piece is she the only one working on it? The signature dress. So I do not see the problem. Uh. <laughs> <Cupcake>. Nice. <laughs> First of all, Sassy Saddles, I would have appreciated getting to name the final gown from my collection myself. <laughs> My research shows that your Rain in Stain name was a play on words that was both very confusing and quite unappealing. Can you shut the While fuck I up? See your point, we should have discussed <laughs> it prior to the grand opening, yeah. Sassy. My only goal is for Cantalot Carousel to succeed. That's why I changed the name, and that is why I took Run it by rarity. You can't just make executive decisions by yourself. <laughs> Dresses in one day it, it, it's just too much too soon are you actually saying we should cancel these orders what do you want to make the hundred dresses no, no sassy promises were made and <laughs> and i shall sew my very best to provide each and every pony a princess is no dress one gonna help her sew these suits oh, thank you rarity thank you <sighs> where's coco Coco can help you. Oh, satin and silk, Rarity. Are you sure you don't want your friends to help you make the dresses? No, Sassy. These orders are my responsibility. All oh. I have to do is stick to my plan so I can... <laughs> if you think you can do it. ...in keeping with my rules of Rarity. The song? <laughs> the rules of yep. Rarity. Rarity has such a beautiful singing voice. With time, love, and couture. Tender love and care. Hey, that what what's that one's name? She getting all the dudes. <laughs> You're making her the slave one while you get to live the dream. This is Rarity's boutique. Why are you doing this without asking? Now you made it a sad song, and now I'm probably going to tear up for the 10th time this season. Don't women get really upset when they wear the same dress as another woman? Okay, yeah. Yeah. Give me some clarity. Time for your coach, your love to rule. That just made a mess. Rules of rarity, extra TLC. This feels more sublime. <laughs> so now they will see how good these can be with a little extra shine. You 
made it even better. <laughs> POV. Where did she pull that from? Sassy, you don't give orders. Paisley and Poplin Rarity, look at all the orders you still have to finish. And you want to take a break? Now? Whoa! Sassy's pissing me off. <laughs> really lovely changes to this dress. You did what? But every princess dress is supposed to be exactly the same. Yes, yes, I know. But these gems just spoke to me and fine. Go see her reaction. Hello, and welcome to Cancelot Carousel. I'm so pleased to present to you your princess dress, finally! <laughs> I've been simply desperate to get this ever since I saw Princess Twilight. Your kitty mark peppers. Wait a minute. There's something different. It's better. Not taste. I did take the liberty to change a few minor details. But to be fair, that isn't what she ordered. Gems glistening in the light, and they just spoke to me. Aren't they lovely and so unique? They're fine, but they're not what I ordered, are they? Yeah. Uh, no. No, they're not. I want the dress to be exactly like the one Princess Twilight wore. Understand? <laughs> Twilight looks so awkward yeah, in that. Yes, of course. Sassy, stop giving her. <sighs> you gotta fire her. Stood for something, but now it feels just like some factory. Jesus. Now every dress I make, with every flaw and mistake, oh how it makes my heart, my heart just break. This, this is her dream. She can't live it. Oh my god. Raving Rickrack Rarity, you made 200 princess dresses. Damn. Yes. Isn't it spectacular? I have a special surprise for you. Fuck, I, I feel so bad for her. Cosmere magazine just hit the stands. Oh. Cantaloupe hey, Cantaloupe she's the cover. Star. And in the hour since the magazine's come out, we've gotten another hundred new orders for the princess oh, dress. Oh, my God. One hundred more princess dresses. I'm the Cosmere cover pony. I have the most successful shop in Cantalot. I've gotten everything I ever wanted. But, but you're not living I'm the experience. Because <laughs> you're a factory worker. Miserable. My pattern is perfect. You're a pony. Done. You have your signature gown. The princess dress of success. I don't want to make another hundred princess dresses. I have a piece for that. Assemble the assembly line. You never have to sew again. What? No. Yes. Then the Where he wants to make personalized dresses and see the satisfaction on her clients' faces. That's her dream. I think. Yeah, thank you. Success in yes. Looks like I want no part of it. Tell her. Now, make up flyers for a going out of business sale. Okay. I'm closing Cantalot Carousel. You don't need to go out of business. Just make changes. Contrarity. I've worked too hard to make this a success. I can't do another failed boutique. I wonder why they all fail. Nice. Oh, don't you look lovely? Nice to see you out here again. <laughs> see, I bet they all have like their individual personality to her. <laughs> Talks to the dresses. Open the door this time. Hmm. <laughs> Welcome to the going out of business sale of Canterlot Carousel. Hey, is this princess dress on? Hey. I'm sorry, the princess dress has been discontinued, but there are plenty of other lovely dresses on sale today. 
Whoa, this dress completely speaks to my soul. <laughs> I, on. I can tell. <laughs> Amazing of amazing dresses. Oh my gosh, this dress is so big. And I'm sure you'll feel even brighter once you try it on. <laughs> Do you still have this Inspiration dress that's in the new issue of Cosmere? Inspiration. Okay, it's, it's right here. That's in the belfry. I have to try it on. <laughs> Whoa, this dress makes me feel like a princess. <laughs> <laughs> this dress makes me feel like a princess. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful, but it totally clashes with my complexion. Hmm. Perhaps you'd be even more taken with this one. It was this is Rarity's dream. One on one with her clients. I call it the fountain of truth. <sighs> it's exactly what I've been dreaming of. Oh, well, then I'll finish it, and the gown shall be yours. Nice. How can I have forgotten? This yeah. is what I've been dreaming about. There we go. Hey. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm so happy. I'm happy now. <laughs> Attention every pony, Cantalot Carousel will not be closing. Yeah. This stuff's still on sale, right? <laughs> yeah. Yes, yes, of course. Oh, Rarity, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I focused on that one dress, and the rest of Rarity's royal regalia paid the price. Well, so did the princess dress. The more I sewed, the more each dress lost its time, love, and couture, becoming tender, love, and care. Lackluster and common. I think I finally understand the rules of Rarity. And we'll apply them. the rules of rarity. Job. I beg your pardon. The rules of rarity are only to be applied at Cantalot Carousel, which is why you must continue to manage the boutique while I'm in Ponyville. Ponyville? Oh yes, I'll come to Cantalot with new designs and to see the customers, of course. But Ponyville was always going to be my home base. Oh, Bodkins cool. Bodkins rarity. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Sure, you trust her with this? To run everything following your rules. I would okay. We'll see. What the hell? <laughs> what is that thing? <laughs> that you're not gonna find a dress in that body shape. <laughs> I'm just gonna pretend like I didn't see that. I'm a little delirious right now from how tired I am, so I'm just gonna pretend that I just saw that, like, as a vision, a hallucination. <laughs> yeah. But, yep, it's 4.30 in the morning, and I'm probably gonna go to bed. But, as for that episode, that was a, I liked the episode a lot. Uh, I'm really happy I got to see Rarity. She's, she's starting to live her dream. That's really cool to see. Oh, and uh, had a good song. Man, has this show ever made a bad song? <laughs> like, let's be real. Uh, um, yeah, sassy, pissing me off for almost the whole episode, but I think she came around. I think she'll be fine. Um, uh, yeah. Oh, I, fu I forgot to look out for Starlight in the back. God, I'm, I've probably missed her so many times. <laughs> I saw her during Amending Fences, so at least I saw her once. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. Peace.